Hello everyone, my name is Ross and welcome back to my channel. In today's episode we're gonna do a little bit of discussion. As usually I do on this channel, if you go check I have more videos like uh, on this type and in this format basically. This is kinda like I do discussion in news and stuff and I found like interesting, like I found a new situation with iLabs and the sim, the sim thing basically, that's what I want to cover today and talk about that. Uh, so basically if you don't know why dubs is, I, I would like let you just google it or just like search on wikipedia, I know exactly what the fuck you're doing here if you don't know exactly who this guy is, but just like basically if you don't know you can go ahead and google it before you check this or just you can leave. Basically I saw this becoming like a real big deal, people cover it everywhere basically, and I was, you know what, I can like jump a little on it and talk a little about this entire situation, because I think like really like iDubs or Ian we want to call it like in this situation it's kind of like um, not guilty where you can say like mm, it doesn't really have anything to do and with the hate and everything. So basically what happened is that I think like a week ago, I'm not 100% sure, maybe two weeks ago, uh, like the wife of uh, Ian or like iDubs or whatever you want to call him I uh, made like this OnlyFans account, which if you don't know OnlyFans basically, it's kind of, it's kind of this account where you can uh, upload like nudes and porn and stuff from what I understand, it's for like a specific number of people that like pay for this, which is kind of odd to be honest and I'm gonna get later into that, but we're gonna, we're gonna watch this video as well. Let me pull back my headphones because we'll need to listen to this in a few moments. Even though I don't have a webcam, I said let me pull back my headphones, even though I could cut that out, probably I'm gonna let it in to be honest. It's really late and I'm kind of tired when I'm doing this video, but hey, you know what, like, you, you need to do a video, like, from time to time. Yeah, getting back to this, uh, basically, made the account, everybody get got pissed and start calling iDubs a simp, because, like, oh, how can you let your wife do that, or basically that mentality, you know, like, uh, you, now you're not the only one who's gonna see you naked and stuff, like, other people are gonna do that, I, you know, it's just, like, different mentalities and stuff gathering together, and the problem is, like, in the beginning was, like, kind of jokes and memes and stuff, uh, but like people that actually know like to joke and they have like uh you, know, like you have like their own distancing and stuff like to not go and just like shit on someone's private life and start attacking someone you know for what their wife did uh, but yeah like in the beginning it was jokes and stuff and then other people like took it seriously you can see here you can see the video and you can see like it's having a bunch of dislikes and a bunch of likes this is the video where like is responding to this entire thing basically a little bit of defending itself and i didn't watch the video we're gonna watch it together because i wanted to like watch it with you much together so we can just like react and get like get like a feedback i can get like a feedback on it but i'm saying like mostly the situation from i understand like what's happening um and like what is going to talk going to talk about in this video so yeah before i start this video i'm gonna say that like i understand some people but i still don't understand exactly why you have to be mad and just like actually hate on this guy after all it's his wife decision so i maybe if i would be in a, like in a situation like this i wouldn't like it either maybe i would just like leave but he's having the opportunity to leave if he wants or he's having the opportunity to say no i don't like that or do something about that but he he doesn't because he's supportive about it and he accepts it and that's what he he wants to do like what, what the fuck is wrong with that like if it's not his own decision how does that like matter to you or how is that like even remotely affecting you I let the guy do what he wants and also I know like some people are hating on him because he said something in some other videos and I'm not gonna go into that but basically it's kind of taken out of context and stuff uh, what he said and it's, it's actually um, it's even saying like sex workers I dubs complaints I think he was like defending sex workers or something anyway I'm not gonna go into that and, and yeah like I'm uh, probably gonna get some hate on this to be honest but I'm kind of ready to like for the hate I don't care if people is gonna like start disliking my videos because I'm just giving my opinion I'm like a small community just starting to grow up like uh, close to, like 40 subs um, so yeah we're just like you know doing everything we can to start like getting a voice here so like I don't really give a shit what other people are gonna say about this I'm still gonna react and talk and give my opinion about it because this is a free platform you fuckers <laughs> I'm just tired, it's late. Okay, so let's go for it, let's play it. Okay, so editing this, I uh, realized that I used some Doom footage for this. 
which people probably they're gonna relate to me with Leafy it's here they're gonna say I already can see the comments oh dude it's it's Leafy it's Leafy it's back man he's he's using doom footage like Leafy back in the day I, because I, I know that because I was watching Leafy back in the day so hello guys my name is Leafy it's here so let's jump into another video episode of iDubs complains this is a very special episode I'm gonna go full screen. where I get to tackle two topics that I've recently become very passionate about Okay, we're gonna watch the entire thing because it's nine minutes and it's not that long and yeah. That is a section of my audience who thinks they know me and my opinion on sex work. You can sort of see... Okay, I can understand this. And it's right, audience like who thinks like they know me. Like, you know, like don't get offended, but like fuck you if you know like you know this guy. Like, we, we couldn't know anything about him. Like, I would say, this guy from what I can see, and I would tell, as it worked with PewDiePie, worked with Georgie, and other content creators, like big content creators that I kind of like, I would say that it's a nice guy, and he's doing what he's doing with his life. I, I was, like, watching videos from him and stuff, and yeah, but, like, we don't really know him as a person. Like, we're not close to him. I'm a fan of him. Like, I like what he's doing. I'm, like, the biggest fan ever, but, like, I always still watch his stuff. But I'm not gonna say like I know him. I don't know him. Like I don't know anything about him, and I wouldn't even call him Ian. I'm calling it Ian because other people are doing. But like I, even that, like I don't kind of have the right because I don't know him as a person. So yeah, I dub is basically you know unknown to me. Like he could be like anything in real life. I never met him. So yeah, those people who think like they know him, they're like just dumb. They know what they see on in Where front of a camera. Will. So let's go for Collide. this. For those of you who are unaware of the drama I recently brought upon myself, I'll fill you in. My girl. And no, I'll let you know from now, like, my opinion. No, I. Dubs is not a simp. <laughs> so, yeah, like, he, it's his decision. So, yeah. Girlfriend started an OnlyFans account, which is a website where you can upload amateur porn. Anything yeah. from double penetration all the way over <laughs> to lewd cosplay. And every. Yeah, that's true. So, yeah, like, it's her decision after all. Like, like I said. Nothing wrong with that. People are doing that. Like, we live in 2020, guys, so get the fuck grow up. Anything in between. and uh, Maybe if you're a kid, like, you have time to grow up, so it's fine. I think all of it is cool. Yeah, I know. I, I, did I don't think it's cool particularly, but I think it's her own decision, so that's my opinion on it. I didn't think it would be a controversial opinion either. A good amount of people are just doing the reasonable thing and just making jokes and laughing about it. Yeah, that's what I said in the beginning. And it shouldn't be, like, so controversial, but it is. So, yeah. But there's a whole nother group of people who feel personally devastated <laughs> and betrayed. You yeah. lied to us. That's true. Uh, first of all, I'm not your fucking dad. Like, if you don't want to look up to me anymore, that's fine. I don't want you to look up to me. First up, we got Edward. That's true. He didn't ask for it. Oh my god, no, shut the fuck in me. I don't even know, like, can I say those words? Like, is gonna YouTube banish me forever? Um, I don't know, but maybe I'm gonna censor it, I don't know, we'll see. I'm not able to monetize my content, like, I have 40, close to 40 subs, so... <laughs> I'm not even 40 subs, we're like 38, so... <laughs> I said close to it, guys. He probably got told by a lot of people that he looks like iDubs. <laughs> he really liked that, because iDubs was cool, but now that iDubs is a simp, now he's gonna go in full baby wah-wah mode. No, shut the fuck up, you dumb fuck. You don't get to ha-ha funny yourself out of this one. You're- Okay, so this guy's kind of a kid. I don't know exactly. I mean, I don't think iDubs is going after him. It's just like reading the comments. A simp. You act like, all- He- he- p took it like, you know, even his his wife basically no matter what she does like if if she like if he loves his wife it's still his wife so if you go after his wife of course he's gonna be mad about it right I would be mad about it like fuck you what my wife does right it's my own like it's her decision it's our decision nothing to do with you all edgy and cool on YouTube and then go and film your girlfriend shoving anal beads up her ass for OnlyFans afterwards? Fuck you. <laughs> you lied to everyone. You ruined my life. I like how it's reading that left. That's why I'm laughing. <laughs> oh, looks like I did something a little too edgy. Edward, I don't know where you got the idea that I was cool, 
do you think it was cool when I was when I was playing with anal beads? It's cool when I. <laughs> yeah, true. That's right. Like, if no, no, it loves him. You need to check his stuff. Like, he's doing such such a bunch of like I don't know edgy stuff. Like to the point, like like I said, it was recording with Filter Frank. Uh, or Georgie, or whatever you want to call him now, like, now he's Georgie, basically, and don't get me wrong, I, I, I don't, like, hate on Georgie by saying that, I really like Georgie's music, so I'm really glad, like, he found a career on that, and, uh, yeah, I'm sad that he's not Filter Frank anymore, but, like, he's not doing that anymore, because he could be at any times, that. Uh, but basically, they did a lot, of, like, a lot of shit together, which was crazy shit, like, I, I'm not gonna do that, like, ever, not for a video, not for nothing, like, eating... Uh, cake with hair and stuff so like if you want to go into that just go and look up but jesus christ man i play with anal beads <laughs> do you think it was cool when i was running around in an oversized cop outfit that was cool to you yeah that was really it's because cool he's a <laughs> he makes content cop and targets people but he himself have girlfriend whoring herself <laughs> he does nothing about it what jesus am i gonna do christ, man. you think i should just like take a shotgun to her head no bitch it's time to die now. You're holding yourself and just like shooting in the head. No, I you should break up with her. But I'm cool with it. You do realize there are guys... Yeah, true. Like, that's what I said. Like, if it's cool with it, like, what's your fucking problem, mates? I don't get the other people, to be honest, in this part. Out there in private right now, jacking off to your girlfriend. But I guess it's out of sight, out that's of mind, true. it's not a problem. You think these fucking retards would actually do a smidgen of research? Because, like, I did it, and I found the potential hypocrisies in, in what I say in the past, and it's it's pretty fucking... Cons uh, okay, so now she's referring to the past part, which was said, uh, like, I'm not gonna go into it, but let's listen to it. Assistant. The funding for the slut shirt is actually very, very low. Skanktown. Skanktown, <laughs> USA. Softcore porn all over the walls. Yeah, it's taken out of context, and he was doing, like, fun and stuff, so, yeah. You know, sometimes it's, like, like it's a difference when it's kind of satire, and it's, kind of like, made for fun purposes and stuff, and, like, he's not really serious, but, like, yeah, no, don't nice, huh? do all of it. You know, like, I'm not saying that women should be sexualized or shouldn't be. I'm just saying that there is the market for it, so it makes sense that they would do it. I would say skank and slut. But never was that part of my argument. It's just flavor. It's just flavor. Like, True. in the future, I'll probably say slut and skank <clears throat> again. I don't know why everyone thinks that, like, I... He's right. He's just, he's just flavor. He's just, like, satire. He's just fun. So, yeah. Made a, a stand. I stood on top of a hill, and I proclaimed to all my uh, loyal Christian followers, <laughs> no porn shall ever cross my screen. No woman <laughs> that I date shall ever lower her standards to the point of being half naked. Let me have my hope, all right? I want to believe he's too intelligent for this. Intelligence has nothing to do with it, but I will say this. If you want to retain hope that I'm intelligent, uh, this is the most intelligent thing I've probably ever done, is, is revealing this side of me, that I'm okay with sex workers and girls being slutty. It has no bearing on my life whatsoever. <laughs> and the sooner you realize that True. for yourself, the better. I wanted to talk more about all the shitty takes that people have, and this guy that we're gonna watch has pretty much listed all of what the arguments are for people. Okay, let's who go back. Don't I wanna do that. And this has pretty much the arguments. Are. Okay, so this guy is saying pros and cons. Pros, of course, nothing. Cons. Every, everybody, everyone can see what he sees for a few dollars. Or for five dollars, I don't know, for a few dollars, I guess, a dollar sign, I guess. Um, so yeah, that's right, like everyone, everyone can see that, but in the same time, do you like see anything special if you think about it? Like, I do respect the intimacy of two people having that if they want to have that, but in the same time, like, it's just a body. Like, if you go watch porn, right, and you see like a bunch of bodies, that doesn't mean you can, like, I don't know, like violate that image like that's still gonna be like a naked body like no matter who sees it right it just like applies to you in that moment it doesn't really apply to the other people so i don't see that like being a point there or like a con or whatever uh removed uh a red store what <laughs> I, I don't get that one. 
um, Internet is a Forever Archive, uh, not really, Future Jobs, so you can still get future jobs, you can just go for pornography if you want that, or you can still get future jobs if you worked in porn, so I don't see that as a con either. I don't get the second one, remove a uh, red uh, ah, pedestal, remove pedestal. But what is, it, what is it referring to, like, remove pedestal, you just, you don't have, like, a, you can be above, or, or, I don't get that one, fuck it, let's see. So, <coughs> for people who don't morally agree with the situation. So, okay. on the cons, we have, everyone can see what he sees for a few dollars. And there are pros, you can get money, you can get a career in that if you want, so, yeah. It's what you want to do, so, yeah. Dollars. What exactly do you think I'm saying? I think this guy is just hating for the, like, the meme and stuff, so... Uh, I'll be honest, like, I think he's doing it for the views. I might do it for the views, so it's fine. <laughs> do you think she's shooting fire? <clears throat> My voice is just, like, pussy? fucking dying. Do you think <clears throat> she's screening the Matrix Reloaded down there? It's not a mystery, it's a pussy, dude. No, there's no special pussy. It doesn't become less valuable the that's more true. people see it. That's what he's always saying case, too. My body and my person is the most valueless thing on the. Yeah, of course, like your naked body doesn't compare to that, like a pussy, basically. But it's still like he's right. It doesn't have any value. Like you, your body has value to you, basically. If you want to sell it to other people, then it might have value to other people. But um. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's it's, it's just what it is planet the internet is a forever archive so there's no uh i regret delete all button that's not quite there i don't know why this shitty point is being made true uh, it's sort of like from 2003 yeah i know so it can be deleted or just like cool, so yeah. didn't know if you knew but uh, <laughs> when you upload something yeah. it might stick around this isn't done impulsively like what what do you think someone's just gonna make an only fans just yeah, and I agree, like, and one more thing here, like, just to add, because, like, basically, I don't know ex if Ian is just already, like, like Ian, I don't know exactly if he's just going to say this, but because, like, I can hear what he's saying. Um, so what I was trying to say is that, never mind, let, let's hear it to the end. On a whim, didn't give it any thought, just thought me. Yeah, that's what he's trying to say, too, like, I think he's going for the same thing I was going to say, like, of course they think this through before. Like, they probably made this decision together, so, like, you being a retard out there, like, you're kind of the person who was left off, you know? Like, they made this decision together, they knew they, what they were doing, so it's their own decision, so why the hell are you in their life anyway? Like, goddamn, I know they're, like, public figures, because they're, like, on internet and stuff, but, like, we all public figures, if you think about it. Like if if Vidabs is just like gonna start messaging you in private, asking you why you why, why you doing that and why you posting that on your Facebook account or Twitter, would you be happy then? Or attack you as a YouTuber, for example? I don't know, like attack Maybe you for I'll your my aspect, like you have long hair or something. Pussy online and see how it goes. And then future jobs, they might be a little bit harder to come by. I think this is one of the most important opinions to highlight because it really demonstrates a severe lack of real world experience when you're saying that future jobs are going to be harder to come by that's because correct. of an OnlyFans account. Like, if you think this affects your standing <laughs> or your social credibility in getting jobs, you are so sadly mistaken. True. And I will also you can get say, more jobs. if you want a morally <laughs> grandstand, one of the shittiest things that I think you can do morally is judging someone about what they did previously and not hiring them even though they're qualified for the job. This is straight out of the playbook True. of the boomer who's decaying in his lazy boy, who, who wants to tell you, no, nah, that ain't going to work. You, no one's going to hire you <laughs> looking like that. The bone through your nose? Yeah, forget it. <laughs> yeah, the stud going through your tongue? No one wants sluts working for them. And the dyed hair? Don't get me started on the dyed hair and the tattoos. No one's going to hire you looking like that. Yeah, that's my true. head. It's there would be like uh, old, so many other thi old mentality, basically things to do and make money before they need to hire you, like for what you're qualified and not for what you like, how you look. Of course, there are gonna be some jobs where maybe some tattoos or something like it's not okay. Maybe I know you're working straight with a customer or something like real life. Let's talk. Let's be honest. But um, it's it doesn't apply all the time.
stooping the to price to some position but not like to everything this point i find it very fascinating that uh, commentary youtuber who's known for criticizing others much like me would be willing to take the position that sex work is beneath them uh that they aren't on the same level as sex work <laughs> that's fascinating i find it really interesting that that is the uh that's the position you want to take. I wouldn't put like commentary channel as a basic. I, I don't want to put sex work as low as mole. I wouldn't. I wouldn't put them in the same category. Um, I think they're two different, two really different things. And I think like uh, you know, when it comes to sex workers, sometimes it could be a little lowering or degrading what you're doing compared to like when it comes to YouTube or something like this. But like I said in the beginning, it's like their own choice on what they're doing. And they're like fully aware going into it, so yeah. We're like, we're here on YouTube, we don't suck dicks, you know? Are you sure that we don't suck dick on YouTube, bros? I don't really wanna overreact. I don't wanna make a video with that twat. I don't really wanna eat that. YouTube ho, YouTube ho, I suck that'll age quite nicely you can add extra money as well which i mean i don't know if it's really needed in that household consider the dude will pull like three million views off of reviewing peanuts but um okay sounds like someone's a little bit so yeah that's someone's a little bit salty you know but um yeah i i, I don't f i don't want to believe 100 percent it's for the money but i don't know Maybe it's for the attention, maybe it's for something else. Maybe you should just want to try it out. I don't know. It's what it is. Salty. You do realize that if your partner is making a lot of money and is very wealthy, that doesn't automatically make you feel fulfilled in the relationship. True, and couldn't even apply to you. Like you don't need the like you don't need the whole time to split split, so uh, but yeah, you're probably gonna split with your partner, that's what I'm trying to say. It's more like where it, like something goes wrong, right? You need a career, you need a path as well, so I know you just pick what you want to do, right? Or feel like you're contributing enough, because based yeah, on your that's, that's argument, true. then I guess Jeff Bezos' son just should never work at McDonald's. There's enough money in the family. I think there's enough money in that household. No reason Philip Bezos needs to go on OnlyFans. Yeah. He doesn't need to lower himself to that standard. The <laughs> world would be a much better place if people like Philip Bezos, I don't know if that's his son's actual name, but <laughs> if Philip Bezos did OnlyFans, that would be a perfectly fine thing to do. I think what I've learned from this experience is when you're speaking to a large group of people and uh, there's some dudes in the back shouting out their opinions like i fucking hate thoughts i hate whores women who <laughs> sell their body online fucking suck that's the worst instead of ignoring that and just moving on with my lecture it might be a better idea to point those people out and say yeah i actually don't agree with that shitty opinion um because it, it seems like me just ignoring it has led to uh like a cult through it through the idea is like basically he didn't vocalize his opinion and now people are just like uh they think what they want to think and say what they want to do cultivation of a bunch of retards that That's pretty true. much wraps up this video i love my girlfriend and i'm totally fine with dudes jacking off to pictures of her <laughs> on the internet it doesn't decision. affect me one way or the other if you are upset by me admitting this then uh, I suggest you go idolize someone else. Someone who isn't a simp or a cuck. Someone who maybe just gives shitty opinions instead. <laughs> okay, so that's it for the video. Um, I don't have anything to say, I think, anymore. Like I said in the beginning, I think the dude is right, and I'm like supporting him into this. 
Because, because, because people like to be assholes and when people kind of like find a wagon and stuff, they just jump on it like I did in this situation, but I'm not here to hate. I'm actually here to support because it's nothing that this guy can actually do. If he didn't like it, he could just step away and it's nothing you could do to make that because it's his own decision. Like, and then if you didn't like it that he stepped away, then you'd be like, oh, oh like, oh, I dubs left his wife because she's doing only fans and stuff like that. So, yeah, anyway. Uh, this episode is too long anyway and right now I'm gonna do probably some cuts and um, we'll see what we'll get to it because I'm like really tired so I'm probably gonna get some sleep. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're like hating on this because of my opinion go ahead and just like hit this like and comment whatever you want. Um, I'm not gonna hide here I'm just gonna reply to you. Um, if you have any comments and criticism of course if you just don't swear like a retard that would be okay. And uh, if you like what I said, give a like and support and everything. Yes, usually we just like growing channels. So if you want to see more, also do let me know. Because I'm going to do more videos like this. But not, of course, like not always reacting to this type of content. So yeah, guys, uh, as always, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.